Um, maybe actually your point number five could help with this, but you say, read as much as you can. Um, my question here is, are there one or two books that you, that should be on everybody's bookshelf? No, <laughs> they're really not. I mean, I, and, and I've always been a, uh, I've never been a believer in top two, top five, top 10 lists. I don't yeah. like lists. I think that I, when I counsel people to read as much as they can, uh, I'm really suggesting, um, I, I, and, and of course, I, obviously I understand that there are limits, but I'm really suggesting um, uh, variety. Uh, I, I will say that. So I won't, I won't give you names of sp specific titles, mm. but I will say that everyone should read, every business person or aspiring business person, every business student should read fiction along with nonfiction. We, if we read a daily newspaper, which we should, uh, a financial newspaper, a, 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 a general business, a, a general newspaper, uh, like Süddeutsche Zeitung or whatever it might be, um, th those things are all good. If we read uh, nonfiction books about our particular field of interest, those, those things are good. We should also read fiction because in the world of fiction, if you will, the world of make-believe, there are a number of gifted authors who help us understand fully what it means to be a human being. And I will just lift up a couple. I will mention a couple of, uh, a couple of authors that I like. And there's nothing very highbrow. I mean, I'm not going to invoke some esoteric author. I'm going to talk about bestsellers, OK? And there's a, there's a, um, there, 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 there are a number of writers. There's a, Swedish, a young Swedish writer, a young Swedish novelist named Frederick Bachman. Uh, and Frederick Bachman's published uh, five or six best-selling works that have been uh, widely published and translated all over the world. And Bachman has an astonishing ability to see uh, inside uh, people. Um, and there are a number of other, there's lots and lots of other uh, authors. Alexander McCall Smith, the Scottish writer, uh, hugely prolific. This guy, I think, is 80 years old. He's published like 40 books, 50 books. He writes a book a year. His books are fun to read, but they're so insightful about who we are as people, how we think, how we behave, how we interact with other people. So I think fiction is really good. Okay. And I mean, building off of that too, I think science fiction has had a very you know, important and prominent role in determining innovations that would be happening, kind of shaping the future sure. of what it looks like. Sure. So, you know, I, I agree. I mean, I'm a huge Tolkien fan um, for when it comes to fiction, but yeah, I'll definitely look into these, um, these other authors.